So I'm in a basement today doing a home inspection and um, so it has a poured concrete foundation wall. So I just wanna show you guys a couple things here um, that I see on probably every every concrete, poured concrete foundation wall. Um, I'm gonna flip the camera here. So um, a lot of times you'll see this line here in the in the poured concrete. It's a, this, like a different color. Um, you kind of see it all the way around. See it kind of continues here. Um, and then it, even over here, um, this is the first time I've ever seen one with water penetration. You can see that line there. So that's actually a cold joint. So what happens is um, when they're pouring the concrete, um, they build up their wood forms. That's why you see these um, rectangular looking uh, shapes on the wall. Um, so they'll pour the concrete up, they'll fill it up to here, and then they'll, they'll run out of concrete, they'll bring a new truck in, and then they pour this top part. So where the two um, layers of concrete mix, um, that's where you get that cold joint. So um, another common thing uh, is you get these vertical cracks. A lot of times you'll see them at um, corners of the windows where you get a little bit of um, shrinkage in the concrete after it cures. Um, typically what we would recommend for something like this that is letting water in is um, uh, epoxy injections. So, and this one over here is a little bit of, see this one too, they try to seal it with um, like some type of surface sealer, but it didn't really do much here, still leaking through. You see all the water down there. And then this one has a combination of, there's a vertical crack there at the window. And then uh, it meets this cold joint here. I think it's causing them together, causing some water leakage. You can see it right underneath the flashlight. That cold joint line runs around. Right under here. Yeah. Getting some water staining there. Um, these things are not uncommon um, for concrete walls. Typically, the um, cold joints are never an issue most times. Um, but I get questions about them a lot, and just wanted to point that out.